Good morning. All right, back over here at the One Week Wonder Tent. Guy's been working really, really hard in the kitchen last night. This thing has wings. Update on uh, One Week Wonder for, uh, uh, we're about uh, two and a half days out from completion. We got wings on last night. Uh, wings are rigged. Uh, we got the motor mount. We're just about to get it on its gear. Rudder pedals are in, tail's about to go on. Uh, so it's turned into an airplane. It's looking good so far. So we're on track right now. We're looking to do a, uh, a canopy this evening, uh, also windshield, and hopefully get the instrument panel in. So yesterday we were able to get all of the holes uh, lined up for mounting the fuse box and the fuel pump right behind it. Uh, also, we were able to uh, mount the oil tank and the battery in place. We also have the fuel filter in place. And uh, now we can start uh, finishing up the fuel system. Uh, once we get the fuel pump and the fuel lines in place, uh, we already mounted that. We mounted the fuse box, that's going to stay in place now. And then we're going to start uh, installing all of the outside fuel system. Once we get the fuel system almost situated, then we'll start uh, getting the engine in place. Hopefully we should have that uh, done this afternoon. Um, and then we'll start mounting all of the systems, like the cooling system, the oil system, and then uh, hook up all of our electrical systems together. Uh, once we have all of our systems together, we should be able to mount the prop and then the, uh, uh, the spinner on it so that we can uh, perhaps do a test run, hopefully by the end of tonight, if not tomorrow morning for sure. Um, and that's the update for today. So last night we went ahead and mounted the titanium gear legs into the motor mount sockets. Um, we set our gear, gear leg sockets that have our axles. We're setting our brakes, getting our wheel bearings packed, getting our tires inflated. Um, we had to drill for our cotter pins at the end of the axles for the, for the castellated nut. We're going to be tapping the axle itself to accept the wheel pants. And by the end of the day, hopefully we can get it on all three wheels. We're going to work on the tail wheel as well and get that mounted and get everything situated and get it off these sawhorses. So over here on the wingtip, uh, we're working on aligning the fiberglass piece to the wingtip. Uh, it has to be clearance a little bit, we have, so we cut back the fiberglass for the spar to fit through. And we got it all clearanced. We're going to Cleco it in and drill everything. Uh, by the end of the day, it ought to be in copper Clecos, ready to rivet. The other side's doing the same thing. They're working on the wingtip light, too. All right, everyone, so there's your uh, morning, mid-morning update. A lot of work done last night, a lot of work going on right now, so checking with you a little bit later on this afternoon. We are partnering with great companies like Dynon Avionics at Dynon.com, AirTech Coatings at AirTechCoatings.com, Aviation Youth Magazine at AviationUSA.com, The Aviators Clinic at AviatorsClinic.com. Take a moment to go visit their websites at the links found below in the description of this video and visit our website at experimentalaircraftchannel.com for events, our video library arranged in easy to find playlists on specific topics, 
affiliate products, aviation merchandise, and so much more. Everyone ready? Three, two, one. First landing. You gotta flex, you gotta flex or something. <laughs> All right, put the engine on. Act like you're swimming. Let's use our power plant. <laughs> it's Nino power.